all those driving videos and all those hunting and fishing videos come at a cost. It's time for some vehicle maintenance. change the oil in the Silverado why because I'm cheap all right guys the drain plug is a 5.8 it's located right here there's your oil filter oh Jesus Five eighths, boys. The drain plug is a 15 millimeter. Let's see if we get that broke loose here. To drop the drain plug in the pan or make a huge mess. Hey, here we go. Didn't lose it. All right, we'll let that drain for a bit and we're going to go up top. done there got a little bit uh, spilled out in the driveway no metal on the end of the drain plug put this back in get it tight back up Yeah, we should have snug. All right, now we're gonna pull the filter. Come on now, let's go. Ew. Try this tight. I did that last time too. Okay, so what you want to do is make sure you drop this filter removal tool in that used oil. Just to ensure that it is lubricated before you try and take the filter off. See, I want to put it in there again. Okay. Some of you might be tempted to cheat and not change the filter. I'd be lying if I said I'd never done it back in the day. With twelve dollars, change the filter. All right, let's go up top and get the other stuff ready. All right, this uh, Chevy engine calls for a zero W twenty. I'm using synthetic. 
this is five liters and it takes i think six so that's why the extra oil is there uh they didn't have the other fan filter that i normally got but this one here's a tg10575 it was about 12 or 13 dollars we'll prep that right now what we're going to do is so we prime this by filling this up and putting oil around the seal and put it back on all right the new filter is in drain plug is in everything's tight we're gonna clean out our funnel and we're gonna put some more lubrication back in this situation clean all right that's five liters we're gonna pull the dipstick and see where we're at I'm gonna say we need some more. All right, now let's see where we're at. We're up there now. Clean this off. I'll do it one more time. We got plenty of oil now. All right, we're good. We're also going to have to get the pressure washer out. Not today. To clean up that oil. She's going to lose her mind. Which, I don't want to look at that in the driveway either. Anyway, I'll get my tools picked up. And I'll be right back. Just gonna pull the truck up a little bit while Jen's home. Trying to hide the uh, oil marks of the driveway. She told me I gotta park in a road. She'll notice. So I uh, walked over to the garbage pail to throw away my dirty towel and I have my keys in my hand I threw away my keys on the oil rag but how I roll nowadays do is we're gonna fill this with oil if you don't fill this with oil what happens is is it takes that what happens is, is it takes that much more oil out of the block out of the oil pan to fill this up so you're gonna be short 